Hi, Dr. Roger Smith here again. I'm an upper cervical chiropractor in Huntington Beach, California. We've already talked about the lateral view or the x-rays and curves and how the curves in your spine affect your body's ability to function on a daily basis. Today I want to talk to you about the weight of our head and how it weighs about as much as a bowling ball. I'm going to show you the impact that that has on our spine and our ability to function on a daily basis. Okay, again as we've seen before, this is a near normal or textbook tech, uh, neck curvature. Uh, the C shape or banana shaped curve to the cervical spine is the optimum position to hold the weight of our head up. Now with the misalignment in the spine, many times around the upper neck area here, it affects the nerve distribution coming from the brain out to the rest of the body and it can affect the muscle tone in our spine. What it can do is it can change the posture of our spine. Now if we look over here, this is a patient who has had stress on their upper neck and instead of having the C shape or banana shaped curve, they now have a forward curvature to their neck or a forward tilt to their neck and also a lack of curvature. What this has done is it's put an extra amount of stress on their spine and what it can do is we've, uh, they've measured actually the weight of the head which is about 10 to 14 pounds is normally distributed back here on these joints. When our head shifts forward like this, it actually quadruples the amount of strain or pressure that the body has to support on the upper back and shoulders just from this head leaning forward. And so we're going to take a look and see how our head, how we hold our head is affecting our posture. Now, if we think about our head as like a bowling ball, because our head weighs about 10 to 14 pounds on the uh, average adult head. So if we have a bowling ball and we have the curvature in the neck like we've seen here with the proper curvature, it's kind of like holding the bowling ball straight in like this, close to the body. It's not too bad. We could hold it here for quite a while. I mean, I feel the stress and the, the weight of the bowling ball, but it's not too bad. Well, what happens if our posture changes, just like if I change the position of my arm and I start to hold the bowling ball out like this, just like with the neck that's holding the head forward and like this, it's putting a lot more strain. And I can feel the pressure in my bicep, my whole arm is starting to feel this pressure. Now if I stay like this for a half hour, like while a person would be like working on the computer or watching television, in a while my hand, my arm is going to start to shake here. Well the same thing happens with the muscles in the neck. They go into spasm and we start to feel that pressure. What we can do with the care we do here in the office, with the upper cervical work, we find the cause of the problem that's causing the neck not to function like it's supposed to, help get that back into alignment, help get your body back into a, a better balance and help to reduce pain in many cases. So there's many people that may be candidates for relief that may not even know it. And if you just take a look, you may be able to see yourself with that kind of head carriage or head position. So take a look at my website for more information. It's www.rogersmithdc.com. Your health starts here.